Imagine a tempestuous sea, a vessel dashed against its merciless waves, a tale as old as time, yet as fresh as the salt air, where every wave is a heartbeat, every gust a sigh of the indifferent universe. This is the stage set for Stephen Crane's The Open Boat. It's a narrative spun from Crane's own experience, a shipwreck survivor's tale. Four men, the correspondent, the oiler, the cook, and the captain, are thrown into the dance of survival against the vast, unfeeling ocean. Their lifeboat becomes their fragile sanctuary, a tiny speck of existence against the unfathomable expanse of water. The sea, indifferent and relentless, serves as the story's antagonist, challenging the men's endurance at every turn. They row, they toil, they battle against the elements, their bodies ache, their spirits waver, but they push on. Through shared stories, fears and hopes, they forge a bond that's as deep as the ocean they're adrift in. Theirs is a fraternity built on adversity, a testament to human resilience. After days of toiling against the elements, they finally spot the distant shoreline, a beacon of hope in their sea of despair. Yet, the sea isn't done with them. The treacherous waves near the shore threaten to capsize their boat, pushing them to their limits. And then, the resolution. Three of the men, against all odds, manage to reach the shore. But the sea claims its due. The oiler, the strongest among them, the most resilient, does not survive. His life is taken by the very sea they had battled, a poignant reminder of the unpredictability of nature and the fragility of human life. Stephen Crane's The Open Boat is a tale of survival, of human resilience against the unpredictable wrath of nature. It's an exploration of the deep bonds forged in the face of adversity, a testament to the human spirit's indomitable will to survive. It's a story that echoes through the ages, a timeless narrative of courage, camaraderie, and the bittersweet taste of survival.